Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Angie, and if you're new, welcome. Thank you for checking out my videos. Um, today I'm gonna do a review on my favorite Urban Outfitters um, t-shirts that are actually the graphic t-shirts, and they're pretty popular um, um, at the store, especially because they have like really cool like band logos and really cool like floral and like kind of like cool skater looks on them, and it's very vintagey. It's very fashionable it can literally go with anything and I tend to wear these shirts every day um, just because they're so comfy and I can literally wear it with like bicycle shorts leggings ripped jeans and sandals and like van shoes and it can like make a really cool outfit so um, that's my go-to outfit these days and um, yeah I have a quite I have a quite a collection of these urban outfitter um, t-shirts and I wanted to show you guys um, the ones that I have and I'm gonna talk about like um, if they're like the ones that I wear a lot if they're the ones that I wear the least um, my first impressions on them when I started wearing them um, I'm not gonna try them on this is not a try on haul this is just um, showing you what I have and I will let you know um, um, how I bought them online because also too they can be quite expensive um, you know, it's Urban Outfitters at the end of the day, but um, there's a way that I was able to like, you know, afford these by doing um, a certain payment. So just um, stay tuned for the end. And um, so yeah, I'm going to get started on my shirts. So the first one, um, this isn't, this isn't any order. It's not my, it's not my least to favorite or my favorite to least. It's just whatever I have in this pile that's right next to me, I'm gonna show you. So this is my first one. Okay, so this is um, an oversized like gray um, t-shirt and it um, has like the band Rush on it. So that if you're wondering what Rush means, that's what um, this old school classic rock band is and it has like really cool like print. It's kind of like almost like a tour tee in some sort of way. But yeah, it's a dark gray color. Um, it's very comfy. Um, it's long, as you can tell. I like the print. Um, so yeah, I love the colors too, and that's why I got it. But I really love like old school like concert shirts that um, that like have like really cool like you know '70s kind of like disco and Woodstock era kind of like writing. <laughs> so that's why I like this. So yeah, that's my rush. And then the other one. Um, I don't actually remember if I did get this one on Urban Outfitters, but it is by Urban Outfitters, and this is like really cool sun sunflower tea. Um, I got this like about a year ago. Um, I, actually, I got it on Tilly's, but it was by Urban Outfitters, so I think that's really cool. But it's like um, it's got sunflowers, got some Japanese writing on it. I think that's Japanese writing, and then I don't know if you can tell by the material but it's actually very um kind of like worn out but that's a really cool effect so yeah this other one i got is um my Aaliyah t-shirt rest in peace queen i just like how it has like a 90s like you know kind of um little um pictures on this um just to remember who she is it's very comfy um it doesn't feel quite big on me but i mean once again it's long and it has this like really cool dye dye on the back or on the bottom so that's really cool but nothing on the back so yeah this one i think a lot of girls um have this one as well so this one is um, a moonshine kind of pink peach um color if you can tell um but yeah um this is actually more smaller on me because it's not really like a oversized oversized tea like the other ones are but um it's really pretty it's i like the color and it's something different than i wear other than black so i just wanted to try something new but i like that it's, it looks so tropical it almost looks like a beer logo on it <laughs> even though i don't drink beer but i just thought it was really cool i like how it looked and so yeah that's a good one um this one is my one of my favorites um i just, um i needed to get it when i saw it online but this is weezer it says Weezer on it, and it's actually like an oversized vintage shirt, and it's actually a green color. Um, I know you can't really see because it looks gray, but this is what the back looks like, and it says rock music, and it's their Weezer logo. I actually wore this to um, the Hello Mega Tour um, about two weeks ago um, because Weezer and Fall Out Boy and Green Day were there. And um, it was like the only shirt that was appropriate to wear at that time, but I wear this with like leggings and shorts and it's quite comfy. So I think it goes with anything. And I like to wear this actually with like a, a plaid shirt around my waist and some checkered vans and it has a cool outfit. Um, this one I actually just got. Um, this is 
pretty new and I've only worn it one, but it also has one of my favorite bands on it, The Offspring, and it's like an old like um, logo kind of shirt. Um, it says like, you know, Japan, I can't read it backwards, 1999? Yep, that's what it says. Um, yeah, so it's part of their, one of their old tours. It's a cream color. It's not exactly white, but I know you can't really tell because of the light. But um, it's actually smaller on me too. It's not really like a big oversized shirt. But, and I wish it was black because I think this would be really cool on a black shirt and with like other things on it, but it's a cool shirt. Then I have one of the most popular um, graphic tees that is available at the stores and online and it's the Van Halen shirt. I'm sure a lot of people are so familiar with it, but it's um, has holes in it. Um, so if you can tell, there's like some holes in it and it has like the logo and I really like the back. I don't know why, but I just really like the back that has like the old tour dates and this is super comfy. I absolutely love this shirt so much and I love to wear it with like shorts and lounging and like I don't really wear an undershirt under it, but it like really like it's just so comfy and I love to wear it with like anything. So yeah, that's one of my favorites actually. Now this one was um, not really intended to be an oversized t-shirt, but it was a one size kind of thing. So it was this um, skeletons on a skateboard. I thought it was really cool and a cute shirt. So that's why I got it. It has like the backing to it as well. But um, yeah, it's a fun shirt. Now this one is um, a cool shirt to wear in the summer, um, especially if you go to like really cool like music festivals and I would recommend maybe wearing something like this. This is my Nirvana shirt. Of course, it's one of the greatest bands in the whole world. Um, it is also distressed, so if you can see like some holes, there's nothing on that, but I needed kind of like a different color for my oversized tees, so got this one. Now, I don't usually wear yellow unless it's like a mustard color, like a gold color, so this one was perfect and I love wearing it and I just think it's a fun shirt to wear, so. Yep, there it is. Then there's this really cool blue shirt that I have. Oh, and it's um has like an angel, I think, or a cherub, whatever it is. And then this is the back. It's like a really cool like skateboarder kind of shirt, but it's very comfy. I like the color a lot. And I don't exactly know what all this like graphic stuff is, but if you want to check it out, it just says like like the know your worth and there's like these like two little sheriffs like on the bottom kissing and like a polaroid picture and a butterfly and an arrow with um like um i forgot what those are called i can't even talk right now but they're actually like really cool but i like this one a lot i haven't worn it in such a long time too so i gotta start wearing this again and then the next one i have is what do i got here oh this is actually new i just got this in the mail like yesterday it's an outcast shirt has big boy and andre 3000 on it such a great group guys you gotta love outcast that's miss jackson so this is from um one of their one of their albums that had miss jackson the song on it and don't know that song please go listen to it it's a really good song it is like a distressed sort of washed out black color um it's comfy i like to wear it with like um workout shirt workout shorts excuse me but it's cool. It's very like, um, very LA-ish. LA street style. There we go. <laughs> and then there's this shirt. I actually think this color is gorgeous. But it has like a logo on it. And it has like some wildflowers. This would be cool to wear like to a flower festival or something like that. But it's like very like 70s vibe. Very hippie-ish. And I love the little dandelion and little... Um, flower on the side. I think that's really cute. It looks tiring. This one I'm about to show is um, not really one of my favorites, but um, it's a cool shirt and it says eternal bliss. It means happiness, like forever happiness. And it has like a Alice in Wonderland checkers vibe. <laughs> I don't know if you can tell by the mustards and the flat or the mustards. Wow, the mushrooms, um, and the chess-looking um, area and the flowers. But that was my first impression when I got this. So, yeah, it's a really cool shirt. 
Now this one I'm about to show is actually my favorite one out of all of them. And it's not one of the last, it's not the last one guys. So uh, bear with me. But this is my awesome Metallica shirt. Oh, look how cool it is. I'm obsessed with it. I love that the font has like glitter on it. I just like that it's like kind of like grungy looking and I know it looks pretty violent, but I think that's just Metallica style and I love that band too. And this is like their tour dates and this is just such a cool shirt. Like, oh, I love this one so much and I hate to say this, but it is my favorite out of all of them. So no regrets on getting this at all. I just needed it when I, when I saw it, I was like, I have to get this. <laughs> the other one I have is, um, I have a lot of the gray shirts. Um, a lot of, a lot of the color. Okay. So a lot of the urban outfitters, um, shirts, the oversized tees kind of come in the same color, which is like the distressed, like black washed out gray color. So don't really have that much of variety, but it's a Pink Floyd shirt. I really like this cause it just like, it definitely gives off the seventies vibe again. And I'm a big like fan of like seventies rock and like, you know, classic like rock and like all that stuff from the Woodstock era and the disco era. If I could travel back in time, that's where, where I would go. So a little fun fact about me. So yeah, it's a cool Pink Floyd. If anybody listens to Pink Floyd, comment down below. Tell me your favorite band or I mean your favorite song. <laughs> This one is um, one I actually wear a lot too because it's black, but it is a Sunflower Power shirt and look how pretty it is. It actually kind of matches my Daisy tattoo in some sort of way, the one that's like actually right here. I don't know if you guys can tell. Pretty cool, huh? But yeah, it's a fun shirt. I like it. And it's got like some really cool blue and purple on it. You can tell. It's like almost 3D-ish. Yeah? Do you guys get that vibe? Yeah? Okay. <laughs> oh, this one is actually my second favorite to the Metallica one. So I'm going to show you this. This is, this is such a cool shirt to like wear to the beach and just to like, you know, go cruise around down to the coast or whatever you want. But this is my Sublime shirt. Oh my God, it's gorgeous. And it's distressed. Um, I get a lot of compliments when I wear this. I guess it's because this goes good on my skin color, but it's just so cool. And it has like the Long Beach logo. This is like from one of their first albums of Sublime. Um, yeah, my sister actually had this album. So I remember listening to it a lot as a kid, but oh, it's so cool. I'm obsessed with it. And then, oh, I take this back. Actually, this is, I don't know if I should top this one, but this is actually my, my top three. This is kind of between my Sublime shirt and my Metallica shirt, so this is what it's what it is. It is the Red Hot Chili Peppers, and of course, this is my favorite band in the whole world. Not gonna lie, like I have to go see them one day in concert. I will cry. They Californication is my favorite song ever from them, and I just like that it's um, very vintagey, super comfy too. I just love to wear this like with my hair down with some like lot, lots of like layer necklaces, my makeup done. This really is just like my favorite shirt to wear. And no, it's not washed out from wearing it so many times. This is just how it came like, but it's so cool. Now here's a shirt that I don't wear very often. So it's a brown color, but I think it's nice. I kind of like the whole like logos or I don't know what it's representing, but it's like like moons and flowers and I don't even know if that's a cherry right there but it's like I love anything floral so that's why I got it but the brown color is not like the coolest color ever but it works I like to wear this with like black and white checker bands so yeah this is another shirt um that's not also one I wear a lot but I like the blue color this is alive very like zen or what do you call it like very peaceful looking um, very zen. It's like, it's like has like yoga and like peace and love written all over it. The sun is just so cute. Check that out. And I love the flowers too. So as you can tell, I'm already, I'm a big flower person. I love flowers. I love just like anything floral type in nature. So that's really cool. And then this one, it's not exactly a, um, oversized t-shirt, but it's something I love to wear with like leggings and a plaid shirt. It's a Led Zeppelin. 
who doesn't love Led Zeppelin? Immigrant song, whole lot of love, Stairway to Heaven, everything has just been, um, everything from that is just amazing. So I had to get it. One of the greatest classic rock bands ever. So, representing. And then, um, this is actually one of my tops that I wear a lot. And, um, it's a fun shirt. It's by It's Queen. If you can tell right there. It has the same logo, um, that it was on the front. It is also on the back, but it's like in a bigger version. But look how cool it is. It looks like royalty. It's so cool how this artwork looks. And that's why I got it. It's so much fun to wear. And it's very artsy. Like, art is beautiful, guys. So... That's really cool. Once again, it's like a long shirt. And last but not least, a very awesome shirt that I actually like to wear quite often as well. It really should be my top three, but I have too many to name. So um, it's this awesome Nirvana shirt. Um, yeah, that is. this is the picture from their um, MTV Unplugged. Um, me personally, I think that was like one of the greatest like performances they ever did so yeah that's another shirt and then I don't know if you could tell by you can see them right there there's Kurt oh rest in peace Kurt but yeah um I like this shirt a lot and you know this was I like that um one of the greatest performances ever especially before Kurt died is um printed on this so I wanted to get it because like you know I think it's a very cool like you know moment and story and I like that I can actually wear with anything as well. So, so those are all of my shirts. Um, so like I was saying, um, most of these shirts do cost like 36 to $40. That is pretty expensive for a shirt, but there is a way that you can actually um, pay less. Um, and that is if you do like a, every two week weekly pay called Afterpay. So when you buy a shirt online, and this is only when you buy it online. So if you go to like the store, I don't think this is actually um, this is actually something you can do. But it's only if you buy these shirts online. So you, you would go um, to the checkout, and there's actually a place or a little like place where you can click where it says Afterpay, like before you pay um, or you put your your card in your card number to pay. Um, so there's a way that you can pay it and then like every two weeks they'll, um, you'll owe like $17 or $16 depending on how many shirts you're buying. So like one time I bought like three shirts at once and I know that it came out to be like a hundred and something dollars, but I was able to pay maybe like, maybe like 30, $30 every two weeks for, um, four times. So there was payments like of four times and then however much, um, that came out to you would do that payment every two weeks and pay like very little instead of paying the whole thing now it's up to you if you want to pay the whole thing but me personally sometimes like when you're not <laughs> when you don't have a lot of money and you definitely want these shirts i would recommend that but um yeah they are pretty pricey but they are very comfy they go with about anything so i think that they're worth it um and they're comfortable and they just they just make you feel like cool in some sort of way and also the fact that um it's pretty popular it's a popular like you know trendy outfit every girl's wearing them especially like down at the beach and like you can wear them with like you know cool like hoop earrings or like necklaces so I think they really make a great fashion statement no matter what you're wearing with it and um but yeah that is my um, those are my reviews on my Urban Outfitter um, shirts. Um, I wanted to show you my collection. I wanted to share my thoughts on it. I know it wasn't like too, too much, but um, I just wanted to um, show which ones I liked the most and which ones I didn't like the most. Well, it's not that I didn't like the, them the most. It's just the ones I don't wear very much because I know I do have quite a few, as you can just tell. But, um, but yeah, so if you have any other questions about where, um, about these shirts or what else you want to know about them and um you know tell me which one you like the most that I like you know if, if you liked any of them I hope that they're still um online on Urban Outfitters I know these are actually some of these are quite old now but um yeah if you guys like Urban Outfitters um any of their clothes like let me know let me know in the comment bo comments below and don't forget to like and subscribe and I hope to see you guys next time on another video take care